Uh, it's a lockdown time in Bangalore and the entire city is shut but that does not stop us from uh, unboxing some of the best bags we receive. So today we've got a special parcel with us and uh, there are three boxes of cricket bags. So uh, they are from SS Sarin Sports. So every time we unbox uh, it's always excitement and when it's an SS and when they are the top of the line player bags then it's even more exciting and it doubles the fun. So I want to quickly take you through a few of the bags we've got today. So let me just adjust this. So let's open up. open out one by one and go through let's see what we have in store so this is the first one this one looks like a regular ton reserve edition and this looks around 37 38 mm it's got a duck built toe this is a virat kohli this is a virat kohli profile the same profile he uses it's got the duck built toe it's got a big spine it's got the full profile it looks like a 37 38 mm edges Let's see the grains closely. It's got beautiful grains on it. We'll have the photos up of this. Let's check the weight. This one's 1160. So let's write that down. So here we go. It's 1160. Profile again for you. Nice thick handle. SS is doing some nice round thick handle these days. So get in touch if you like this one. This has got the older sticker, from Reserve Edition 2019-20 sticker. I don't think SS has changed. Uh, I don't think they have changed the Reserve Edition stickers as yet. The Tun Tun series. I think the SS range is what has changed. This one does not have any name on the toe. It's got it's got a marking which is rubbed off. Can't really make out who's the player. This again has a tuck wheel toe. It has a slightly higher middle than the previous bat. And looks like slightly bigger edges. This is a oval handle. This is a proper oval handle. You can see the handle. Let's look at the grains. It's got a little bit of hardwood on the inside edge for a right hander. It's got about 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 straight grains. Looks well balanced. Looks slightly on the heavier side. This is 1190. So this is 1190 but picks up well. And oval handle adds to it. So we've got back number one this is the first one 1160 and back number two is 1190. Move to back number three. This is again a ton reserve edition. So we've got three so far. This one is a Rohit Sharma profile. It's got Rohit Sharma's name on the top. And it's got a slight bit of concaving from behind. And see the profile. Let's see it the other way. So this again has a slightly lesser duck build toe, slightly lower middle than back number two, and it's got a bigger spine. And this has slightly broader grain, so somebody who likes broader grains can definitely look at this option. It's got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 grains. 9 perfect straight grains on this stunned reserve edition. Let's check out the balance on this. This is a round handle, thick round handle. It's 1170. So 1170, back number 3. So in case you like this, get in touch with us. This is the 1170 Tundra's of Edition with Rohit Sharma's 
profile with his name on the door. So let's let's now move to bat number four. This one's a different cover, so I'm expecting a different sticker on this. Let's see what this has in store. This is an Andre Russell bat, Dreyrus. A Dreyrus. Let's look at the grains. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 grains on this one. A little bit of hardwood on the outside edge for a right hander. Let's see what the handle is like. Handle is a round handle. Let's have a look at the profile. Again a duck bill toe. It's a mid middle. Slightly higher mid to high middle. With a nice duck bill toe which adds to the balance. Has no name written on it but looks like a handle a silver back. So big spine, huge spine on this one. It's a round handle. Nice balance on this. This is a 12 10 grams. 1 2 1 0. Picks up lighter than 11 20, feels like 11 80, 11 90 in the hand. So get in touch with us. We like uh, Andrew Russell back. Nice big chunky one. Back number 4. Let's move to the next one. This also looks like an Andre Russell with a grip. This has a lot more hardwood, almost 40% of the inside edge covered with hardwood. Let's look at close look at the grains. Some lovely grains coming in today. We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 grains. We'll put up more pictures, more details. You can have a look. Full profile, absolutely full. No wood taken off. It's got duck bill toe. Has no name on the toe, but it definitely looks like a player bat. Let's check the weight. This speed picks up like 1180. Let's see how much it weighs. This is a 1190. It's 1190 grams. Looks like a 40 mm to me. And looks like a 65 mm spine with the perfect grains running right through the toe as well this has a round handle so this comes as a bat number 5 4 and 5 are hundred of bats let's move to the next one this is a Maximus SS Maximus priced lower than the player bats while the lower Bats, one of the better ones, Maximus. This is 29,925 MRP. Has beautiful grains for a Maximus. Let's look at the grains. 10 plus grains on this. Beautiful profile. Nice duck build to again. Big spine, full profile. Absolutely nothing taken out of it from behind. Let's check the weight on this one. This is 1180. It's 1180 grams. Back number 6. This has a lower middle. So a very small duck build to at the end. Very short one. And it's got a nice low level middle for a suspect. So let's move to the next one. This looks like a gladiator in the new stickers. SS gladiator. It's got Moin Ali's name on it on the toe. Looks like this one was headed to Moin Ali. The grains on this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 grains. 11 perfect grains. On this gladiator has a round handle. Let's look at the profile. This is a duck bill toe again. Absolute full profile. A little bit of a duck bill at the end. 
this is 1130 one of the lighter ones we have got 1130 this has about 37-38 mm edges looks like a 62 mm spine I'm guessing we'll have the measurements out soon Greens once more. Yeah. So this goes down as a back number seven. Right. We've got three more. Let's see what these are. This tells me it's a long blade. Let's do a short comparison. Yes, this is a one inch longer blade. This is a gladiator which is a one inch long blade. Just look at the grains, 10 plus again. Profile, duck bill. Nice big spine, full profile again. It's a round handle. And this is a one inch long blade. There's no name written on the toe, but I'm sure this was held off to a pretty tall batsman. Let's check the weight on this. I am six feet tall, so this feels ideal in my hand, so anybody 6 feet and above can look to buy this one. It's 1190. This is 1190, bat number 8. Let's move to the next one. This looks like a Russell bat again. Well, the biggest one, I think this is definitely a 40 mm. Looks like a 40 mm duck bill to much lower middle than the previous Dreyrus we saw. Doesn't have Russell's name on the toe. I'm sure this is one which was made for him. Let's put the grains. Lovely grains on this. Full profile again. Lovely. Round handle. Eleven eighty. It's again a two ten. Amazing pickup, amazing balance. And the last one we've got is a gladiator with a pin grip again. I think one of the best grains we've I've seen. Let's take a look at this. Again, no name on the toe. It's got a much higher middle and a longer duck bill bottom so someone looking for a slightly higher middle bat then bat number 10 is made for you let's look at the greens this is the new branding looks very classy very nice purple one it's got the dual shade embossed sticker this has got this is much darker below slightly on the darker side it's got perfect straight greens Count the grains on this. It's got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 12 grains. 12 straight grains. And at the higher middle. Picks up amazing. This looks like 1180. It's 1190. This is 1190 grams. So let me know what you guys think. We've got 10 best cricket bags. Let's quickly show you once before we leave. Here we go. This was the back number one and two. First three were the Tun Reserve editions. Then we had a couple of Andre Russell bats and a Maximus. And then we had another Andre Russell. Followed by three brand new gladiators of the new branding. Most of them had round handles this time. We had one, I think, which was an oval handle. And we had one which is a long blade. That is this one. So get in touch if you guys want to buy one of these super player bats. Take care.